Hey everybody, how are you doing today? My name is Adam Trotter from microbrokers.com. I'm a real estate agent with Cobo Banker Bain & Kirkland. And today we're gonna to be talking about five ways to stretch your dollar when you're purchasing a home. In this video series, we're gonna be covering finance, smart offers, inspections, home warranty, and home maintenance. Today's video, inspections. Knowing the unknown and planning for the known. All right, so I'm just gonna break it down for you. If you have the time, in your busy schedule to go to the inspection, go. I don't care what you're doing, <laughs> don't care. Go to the inspection. It's one of the most important things that you can really do to understand what you're gonna be purchasing. And if anyone tells you when you're submitting offers, especially it happens here in Washington, if there's multiple offers, they're like, okay, we gotta wait, you know, they're looking at offers and they want you to wait for your inspection. Nope, not the house for you. Why? You're spending hundreds of thousand dollars, millions plus, you need to know what you're purchasing. That's one of our jobs as a real estate broker is to mitigate that risk for you and get that inspection. I don't care who tells you otherwise, inspection is important. It's gonna cost you a couple hundred bucks, but at the end of the day, it's gonna really break down what is gonna happen to the property, really, right? Now, there's some broader scope that I put on here that's gonna be your sewer scope, it's gonna be environmental, that's gonna be septic. Um, you know, if you're purchasing in a rural area that has septic, it's very important that you keep these other specialties in the back of your mind. So let's say you have a backyard, there's tons of different trees and you wanna do a sewer scope because you're just worried about the trees having a tree root in there and messing up your plumbing. Well, the only way to do that is to have a sewer scope. Just make sure you're wary of where you're purchasing and what's around the home. Because again, if you don't, <laughs> it can be an issue long-term for you. That's gonna cost you more and more money when you've already spent a couple hundred thousand dollars up to some millions once you're purchasing the home. Well, everybody, I wanna thank you so much for watching my video today. And I wanna let you know that please go to my website. You're gonna, I'm gonna put a link in here below as well, but to download this buyer's packet, it's gonna break down a lot of the processes, a lot of the verbiage that we have on here. I just wanna make sure you're fully aware of what you're getting into when you start you know, your home buyer's process. Now, the next videos that we're gonna be covering is gonna be home warranty. Thank you again for watching. Like and subscribe below. And if you have any questions at all, put them in the comments and I'll answer them as best as I can. All right, thank you. Have a good one. See you next time.